I'm gonna do my evening out makeup look right now. I'm gonna start with the foundation. This is the Hourglass Foundation and my shade is Vanilla. This Hourglass Foundation is the stick foundation. I've been using it for like five years now. I love it because it makes my skin look natural, like I don't have anything on. And I can add as many layers and it still looks nice, doesn't look cakey. Tatum! What you want? Hmm? So this is how it looks after the foundation. Now let's move on to contour. So I also use a hourglass foundation for my contour stick foundation. But what I do is I get the darkest color, which is chestnut, and I use that as my contour. So just tap right here a little bit. A little bit. And this is obviously, don't judge my contour. I am not a makeup artist. But I do know how to do my face and I really love doing makeup on myself because I know my face, I know what looks good on me and even if it looks a little crazy, you'll see, you'll see the last look. So this is my contour. And then we're going to move on to the blush. So the blush, I put it up here right on my cheek, the top of my cheekbone. And now let's move on to the concealer. And the one I use is NARS. I mix it with the Hourglass as well. I like NARS under my eyes, and then I mix it a little bit with Hourglass around my face to just mix the tones in and if I have like a mark of a pimple or something I use the hourglass usually so the way I use my concealer is like this the little triangle right here and a little one right here triangle line a little dot right here Triangle side, and now I use hourglass for I mix it right here, 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 right here, and that's it. And now let's blend. So I like to blend right under my eyebrows.
And this look, like, it looks like a little crazy when the contour and the concealer and the blush is all over, but it takes me like 10, not even 10 minutes to blend my face and do my face. And sometimes I even just do this look, even for nighttime when I'm going out and I just do a bold lip, which is actually what I'm going to do right now. I usually don't really do my eyes here and there. Like if it's a special occasion, I'll do a nice eyeshadow or like a nice eyeliner, a sharp liner. I love that look. You've probably seen it on my Instagram. But other than that, I like to do a bold lip and just blend in a nice foundation that looks natural. You know, I'm going for that natural look that has a bunch of crazy steps. With the contour brush, I just blend a little bit of the contour on my eyelids. That's basically my eyeshadow. And now blend another time the blush and contour. This little bit of contour right here, I like it a lot when I do like a red lip or any kind of like bold lip. It's little subtle touches that make a difference for me. This is basically the after blend contour blush and foundation okay now we're gonna move on to the brows and for the brows I use this honest beauty eyebrow pencil I love this pencil because I don't only use it for my brows I use it also for my lips when I want to do a nice ombre like mood sexy lip which that's a look for another time if you guys want me to do that one My brows, I just mostly like to do the ends because they're pretty full. And I don't use brow gel, like very rare I use brow gel. I just let my brows do what they want. concealer and also this NARS concealer is the ginger medium too that's the color that I use I do a little right here a little right here my brow look and I'm going to give it a little bit more of glow all over with a little bit of powdered blush and highlighter so this is the blush and I still add it right here
and a little bit more of bronze all over. And then this palette that I use for the bronze and the blush is from Hourglass. It's so cute with the little elephant. And then for the highlight, the final touch, I like to use the Dior Backstage Glow Face Palette. I always use this one right here, the one that is a bit more like gold and silver. And this, I add right at the top of my cheekbone. Tip of my nose. Eyes. And a bit all over because it's so cute. And right here. And now the mascara. So I use this Honest Beauty mascara and it has the lash primer and the mascara. So I, I don't even use the little curly lash thing. I just use this as a primer. This side is the actual mascara. On the bottoms, I just do the little tips. Little touch on the tips. And then I do another round at the top so they can look really long and nice. What I do so that they don't look like clumpy, I use another brush and I just clean the lashes. From that extra mascara. Everything's done on the face, now we're moving on to the lips and I'm gonna do a red bald lip, which is my favorite. And I'm using this lip liner
And with the actual lip liner, I just blend in a little bit on the sides, a little extra. Oh, and I don't take off the excess foundation that is left on my lips. I keep it there because I find that that makes my lips stay on longer. I don't know if it's just in my head, but to me it does. And then I'm going to use for the actual lip, the Yves Saint Laurent Red Bolt Lip, which is the color of 04. And then I go around with the lip liner again just to fix the little edges. Clean around. Okay, so this is the end of the look. Both red lip. Hope you guys liked it. And let me know if there's any other looks that you've seen of my makeup that you want to see me do for this.